Okay, well here's my first test run with the CTC-16. And this is looking at the beautiful Los Angeles sky and we got some chemtrails we can see here. You got the power transformer here and we got chemtrail here, chemtrail here, we got a tree here. This is the support beam of the house and I can adjust the brightness here which just overexposes this camera but it actually looks a lot better than I thought it would and I'm just using a simple security camera mounted right there I'm gonna aim it up at basically what you see on the TV there there's the transformer with the chemtrails there's our little security camera there's a 12 volt supply for it and I am just feeding I'm completely bypassing the tuner and I'm feeding uh, the video into the video amp tube right there so I'm not using any of the IF stages or the tuner As you can see here, none of this has any effect. The brightness, uh, let's see, I get my color. You can actually see the little tree moving there. It's pretty cool. So that's my color gain right there. All it does is kind of makes the sky bluer and increases the noise. And what's kind of cool is you could just turn the color off. You can see it increasing the green. You could turn the color off. You really doesn't even really need to be color. This is the tint shift. You can make the tree go from green to red. Let's point this camera uh, let's see I kind of just hung it on there with one screw so let's point this camera well there I ripped the screw out of the wood let's just set it there come on stay pointed at this lovely apartment thing across the street. We can see the color there. Tint shift. Yeah, I think this is going to work just fine. We don't need it. It doesn't need to be real bright, you know, just... Being able to eliminate the audio section and the IF and the tuner will greatly reduce um, the load on the power transformer in that and the heat. And I have some muffin fans that I will hook up here. And um, I think we'll have real good success. This is going to be awesome.